Dr. Jasmine Chapman and her team at Jackson Hines Comprehensive Health Center are now offering vaccinations at their facility. She says the goal is to provide the vaccine for those most disadvantaged. We want to put the vaccine in the arms. We want to give to the ones that are most needed, the uninsured, the un underserved in this community. And that is what we're going to do. Congressman Benny Thompson says the biggest goal is outreach and that expanding sites as well as full federal support will allow more people to receive the shot. We can also push out locations, not just here uh, at Jackson Hines, but they have other sites that will be made available for people who perhaps are not able to afford the transportation cost or other things. The federal government is now picking up 100% of the cost of many of the sites because some of the sites were not as accessible as others. The health center also has several mobile clinics to provide vaccinations with hopes for prioritizing school systems. All of Hines County schools and many of JPS uh, schools. So we will also be taking these into the schools to make sure that the personnel, the teachers and the uh, employees of, of the school system are also able to get vaccinated. Congressman Thompson says that the American Rescue Plan will be voted by the House of Representatives on Tuesday to provide relief for residents in need. $1.9 trillion package uh, is something that we have to do if we want to get beyond this pandemic. And so uh, President Biden has said, as soon as we do our job, he's going to do his by signing it. And, and I take him at his word. Dr. Chapman says that so far, over 4,000 shots have been distributed through their facility thus far. And appointments for the vaccine can be found on their website. Reporting in Jackson, Kara Peters, 16 WAPT News.